Hello everyone. In this video, I will discuss about the requirement of the a new project called virtual plots. Navigate to the botsdna.com and under the cucumber package, you can find the project called virtual plots. Click on that virtual plots. Here you are booking the land virtually. So download the Excel. I'm just downloading the Excel. Open that Excel. The robot has to loop each and every record from here. Here we have a seller mobile number and seller email ID, buyer mobile number and buyer email ID, and the flat number and square feet. So what the robot has to do, the buyer under buyer check radio button, it has to find the phone number. So let us try the phone number is, some, some phone numbers is starting with a zero. Some phone number starts for the plus nine one. You have to remove those things and all. We have to check only last 10 digit phone number. And this is a, a we find the buyer, Kaja. The buyer, uh, this is a seller. Okay, so then we have to select the seller here. And who is the buyer for this? This is a buyer number. This is a buyer number. So in, in the buyer session, it has select. So the buyer and seller we selected. And then you have a the remaining things like a what is the plat number? And plat number is a 52 and square feet is a 200. Plat number is a 52 and square feet is a 200. And once you fill the buyer and seller names uh, and plat number and square feet, click on the submit. You will get the transaction number. What you have to do, you have to send an email once you book. Once you select the buyer and seller in this list and filling the information, you have to click on the submit and we, we already got the transaction number. So what the robot has to do, robot has to send an email to the buyer and seller. So anyway, the buyer email ID is this, and seller email ID is this one. The seller email ID is in the B column, buyer email ID in the D column. So they, the robot has to send the booking number, that means transaction number into the both. How, how is the email body? Just click on this PDF. This is the email body. The email to send to the buyer email ID and sender email ID into address, both should be up here. And the, and the subject contains the plot has booked successfully and the booking number. Booking number is, so which you just got this booking number. The transaction number is called booking number. And the subject contains the buyer name and seller name. The buyer name, it ha you have to collect from this, the name of the buyer. So here is a Kaja is a seller and uh, Kimaya is a buyer. And the names is there in the description, dear seller name and buyer name and a new plot, plot number is also you have to keep here in the body uh, with the number of square feet and the square feet is also you have to keep in the body. The uh, square feet and plot number is coming from his, this. Uh, is booked on that particular date and time. This date and time is a current date and time, system date and time. And here you can find the booking details like so this table you have to send. What is the booking number? The booking number is like a this. This is a booking number. Transaction number is a booking number. Once you submit all the details, so you will get the booking number. And buyer name, buyer phone number, seller name, seller phone number. Okay, buyer name, phone numbers you will get from here. The buyer phone, seller phone number and buyer phone number. But the buyer name and seller name you will get from the website. So finally, you have to send uh, an email like that, the plot bot. So you had to repeat everything from um, the starting here to end. So all, all the records it has to iterate. 
So that's it. Thank you very much. If you want to, you just try it out. And if you want to see what is up from the scratch in UiPath uh, tool, I, I will explain in this video. Just click on that YouTube link. You, it will redirect you to the, the video where I explained from the scratch, take the plain process and do the actual uh, thing. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.